Well, Lara, one ready? of those Cuban fighters, I talked about it in the opening, with that great amateur pedigree. 300 amateur fights, gross only 21. So expect Lara to have the big edge as far as experience. Forget about the pros. He's been in that ring a lot of times with good fighters in the amateurs. That should serve him well tonight. Lara, he does it from the lefty side of Southpaw. You know, we were looking at the bio of Gross, Joe. And he oh, he puts him down in the first round. Just 35 seconds in. Well, that amateur experience, 300 fight versus 21, it's showing. There's another left hand from Lara. Well, now it goes to the body. Well, you know what I like about Lara is he keeps his range. He doesn't smother himself. Look at the way he's beautifully keeping distance to get full extension on those punches and end his night with another knockout win. Destructive power from Arislande Lara. A first round TKO win. You know, Joe, I was starting to make a statement as the knockdown was scored, the first knockdown. I was going to say that we were looking at the bio of Gross, and he said he likes to cook. I was going to say he'd have to be a master chef to cook up a win here tonight. And it just was not in the cards. He told us about the hard decision to leave his mother, his sister, his two sons behind to find freedom, the ability to try to better his life, to conquer a dream of being a world champion here in the United States. And he's off to a good start to his pro career. Let's take a look at the first knockdown. Again, look at Lara, the way he keeps good distance and the power punch for the southpaw. The left hand, take another look at it, how he turns his back into it. He's able to pivot that left foot Sets it up with the jab and then turns his whole back, his whole body into that straight left hand. And again, set up by the jab. And here's the end of the fight. Keeping good extension and then shifting to the right punch. He's calm enough to see that the uppercut was going to end this fight. Take another look right here. He's calm enough. This is the amateur experience right here. He's calm enough to see that his opponent's leaning forward. So what does he do? He changes the direction of his punch to the left uppercut to end the night. For the official particulars, we send it up to Bob Alexander. Ladies and gentlemen from University Center Arena in Fort Lauderdale, Florida, your referee in charge, Telus Asamino, stops this bout at one minute, nine seconds of the first round. Your winner by knockout, still undefeated, Erislande Lara. Erislande Lara. He defected in 2007 from Cuba. He was returned there. He was banned from boxing. Then he escaped the country again on a speedboat, this time to Mexico. He received entry to Germany, made his pro debut a year ago, and we have seen him skyrocket so far in 09. And Teddy, I got to go back to that first straight left.